Hello, my name is Carl Miwad, and I am a dental student in the ASPID program of Herman Ostro School of Dentistry. I would like to talk to you today to encourage you to apply to dental schools and also to give you a few points that I wish most dental students would know earlier in the application cycle. And also in the very end, I'll talk to you a little bit about USC. So first of all, I highly encourage you to apply to dental schools because the medical field and the dental field in the US has been leaning towards cultural competency as a major factor of offering good health service. Now, being a person who came from a different cultural background and you've been through the challenges that a person goes through coming to the USA, you are in a very good position to help and offer culturally competent health services. Also, uh, being from a specific cultural background, that puts you in an advantage in serving certain cultural backgrounds. Also, you have to know that a lot of professors really enjoy teaching you because as a person who already has been a dentist before, you have a wholesome view of what, what we are doing. So when you're being taught the second time, it's really an enjoyable experience for you and your professors. Now, if there is something that I really wish most dental students, applicants, knew earlier in the application cycle, it is that you really need to choose which school you want to go to. I know it is very competitive and all dental students are tempted to apply to every single school. That's fine, nothing's wrong with that. But you need to know that every school has its own philosophy and it has its own strengths. Having that said, you need to choose a school that matches with your own view and perspective in the way of practicing dentistry. Think of it like marriage. You need to choose the right person because with the school, once you get into the school, you're gonna have the school's last name tied up next to yours. So I highly encourage that before setting up your mind, you need to do good research, reach out to current students who are inside the program, uh, read the school's website carefully, and also meet with the dean, meet with the admissions, meet with the advisors, speak with them and ask many questions and take notes so that you know what every school has to offer. Also, you need to know that every school has a specific strong point, such as, for example, some schools are really good in research, others are really good in community outreach, Others are really good and multiples, have multiple specialties to offer their students. So you need to know what you want to do next and what you want from the school and you need to choose. Finally, in the end, um, I'd like to rave a little bit about my school. Um, honestly, I love my university. I love USC very much. Every single person that I have met has been an incredible delight. I'm telling you, starting from the Dean, to the professors, to the teaching assistants, even the staff that help us are just incredibly amazing people. Um, I remember when we got in, uh, our admission counselor, Corey Berry, literally was treating us like children learning how to walk, getting us into the program. It was just an amazing experience. Um, also, uh, the professors have great expectations of us and they make sure that you meet their expectations. So you're going to become an incredible dentist. I've seen myself and other classmates, the way we used to work in the first month and the way we worked up in the end of the, the first semester and in the end of the second semester, the improvement is incredible. Also, the school gives you a ton of options of things to do next to your program if you're up to it. For example, if you're a person who really wants to do research, there's a lot of options to do research in the school. If you want to volunteer, our mobile clinics are in multiple places in, in LA and around LA. And if, if you want to do other things besides the mobile clinic, there's a lot of volunteering options. Also, if you want to do another master's degree next to the program, you could do orofacial pain, you could do geriatric dentistry. There's a lot of other options of master's degrees if you're up to it, if you want to do it next to the dental program. 
And also there's a lot of other fun stuff that you'd want to do if you don't want to do the other options I mentioned. Honestly, USC is the best thing that has happened to me. And I'm very proud and I'm very happy that I've gotten to, that I have been able to get into USC. And um, for that, I tell you fight on and I'll tell you to be sure to choose the school you want to get into. Thank you very much. Best of luck in your application this year.